Hey YouTube, this is Alexander and I'm back with another tech video. In this tech video I'm going to be taking a quick look at Google Keep, which is Google's new notes application. So let's get started. Okay, so you might have heard of Evernote, which is a, another application, a note keeping application that allows you to take notes and have those notes be synced across all devices that also have Evernote uh, installed as well as uh, you signed in. Well, Google Keep is uh, really similar to that in that it allows you to sync across devices. The interface is a lot different though. Um, it's, in my opinion, a little more simpler and I do enjoy uh, the Google Keep application for two reasons. One, because it's Google and two, because um, I just like the interface a lot more and the way it works. So basically here you have your notes. Uh, if you saw my widget right here on the home screen, you can uh, go ahead and add a widget so that you can quickly add a new uh, note, a checklist, speak a note, or uh, take a picture and get a note. Your widget options are as follows. You have the option to actually have a, a widget that will show you some of your uh, notes or you also have the option of a widget that is just, as you saw here, the ability to add a new note without seeing any previews. So if we go into the uh, Keep application itself, we'll go ahead and hit this and you'll see we get an option to put a title as well as a note. Um, then you can uh, select a new note color, so if you want to have it blue, these will come in handy if you need it for any specific reason. You can also take a picture to add a note. So we'll take a picture of uh, Andy the Android there. And as you can see, he's embedded into my note now. And uh, I can also archive this note, delete it, I can show checkboxes. I can share it with a bunch of different uh, options. Um, then you also have your settings which just allow you to switch your account and then see basic information about like uh, it just shows you which account you're signed into so for right now I'm signed into a uh, certain Gmail and um, if I wanted to switch my account you can do that from the settings then once you press back your note is saved right there now you can swipe whoops now you can swipe to uh, archive and you can also hit the undo if you want to delete a note all you have to do is long press and as you can see here, the delete po button pops up. You can also archive sh uh, share. Um, you go ahead and hit delete. And as well as there is an undo button right there. So the interface is really nice. I really enjoy it. Um, I'll go down a little bit so you can see sort of how it looks. Um, it's just a really nice uh, UI in my opinion. So we can go to my uh, here right here. I have a Google Keep review. I check that. And you can see it's uh, crossed off now. Uh, you can also speak a note. Remind me to pick up milk at the store. Okay, and then once you've uh, recorded it, it'll embed it into the note. We'll go ahead and have what you uh, said as well as a quick voice memo. Remind me to pick up milk at the store. So it's uh, pretty handy if you want to make a note to self type of thing and uh, speak it in case uh, you just you don't have the time to write it down or for whatever reason you just want to speak it. And then you always have add a quick note right up here. So we can do that, and then we can change the color of that to do orange, and then hit the down, hit that down button to take you into the note and edit it some more. To change that color back, you can just start typing, and there you go. So that was Google Keep, uh, Google's new note application. Uh, very simple in my opinion. Um, I really enjoy it. I use it all the time on my uh, devices for my YouTube videos so I know which ones uh, to film and stuff like that. Um, if you like this video and if it helped you, um, go ahead and leave a comment down below. Don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe at the end. Um, let me know what you use. Let me know if you prefer Evernote or if you prefer Google Keep or you haven't used either of them or you've only used one and you're not sure. Um, thanks for watching and I'll catch you next video.